My name is Danny Abu Abdullah. I'm a pulmonologist and critical care specialist as well as a sleep specialist at Genesis Healthcare System. Lung cancer is the leading cause of cancer death in our country. It kills more people than breast cancer, colon cancer, and prostate cancer combined. Um, the purpose of a low-dose CT is to detect lung cancer at an early stage in a group of people that is at high risk of developing lung cancer. And if we detect it at an earlier stage, the chance of um, a better treatment and decreasing the mortality improve. Low-dose CT scan of the chest to screen for lung cancer has been proven to decrease mortality from lung cancer by 20%. So a low-dose CT scan of the chest is a CT scan of the chest. It's an imaging modality for the lungs that involves a smaller amount of radiation um, than a normal CT scan of the chest to decrease the exposure to radiation to the patient. And it is done to help detect lung cancer at an early stage in patients who are at high risk of developing lung cancer. Unfortunately, it is underutilized. We know from the data over the last few years that it has been performed that only about 5% of eligible people with, uh, for lung cancer screening are actually being screened, compared to other um, cancers such as breast or colon, where the screening is a lot, a lot higher. Unfortunately, uh, to wait for lung cancer uh, to give us symptoms is in general too late. When somebody has symptoms related for, to lung cancer, that means that their lung cancer has advanced to a, to a stage that is usually non-curable. Low-dose CT scan of the chest for screening for lung cancer has been proven to be beneficial in smokers um, that have smoked what we say more than 20 pack years which means smoked one pack per, year, per day for 20 years, or two packs per day for 10 years, or half a pack per day for 40 years. So if somebody has smoked for more than 20 pack years, is a current smoker or has quit within the last 15 years, and is between the ages of 50 and 80. This is a group that will benefit from lung cancer screen. My recommendation for our community is if anybody fits these criteria, if they have smoked more than 20 pack years, more than one pack a day for 20 years, if they are current smokers, or if they have quit smoking within the last 15 years, and if they are between ages 50 and 80, they should seek out their physician and request that this low dose CT scan of the chest be performed so they can detect, God forbid, lung cancer early and be treated at an earlier stage if present.